welcome back to Breach Unlimited. Today I have more Hogwarts of Madness um, customs. And, and just for you guys know, um, this will contains very big, massive spoilers for Multiverse of Madness. If you haven't seen it, go watch it in theaters and, more, and Disney Plus. And then after you're done watching it, that will be in like two hours, you can go watch my video. And now let's get into it. We started with America Savage. So, I just use like the regular or land figure you get in the set. So, nothing really to talk here. Just need a Gargantos attack set and you'd be good. But I made my own America Savage and you can see it get right up there. Next is the Fender Strange. I actually really like how this one turned out. Um, so this hair piece, I don't know where it comes from, but it's just a ponytail hair piece. What bad about it, it don't have the like wire on the sides like Dr. Strange. So you can just switch it out with the regular old Dr. Strange hair, but it don't have the ponytail. So if you want no wire on it, use the ponytail, or do, if you don't want no ponytail, use that one. Or now, um, for the other part, just Dr. Shane's face, one torso and legs. Then I just gave him red arms and black hands. And then I gave him this like cloak kind of that would just be cool for the custom. Now on to the next one. Next is this wiggle with Dr. Shane. Just used a middle finger from the Garganto attack set. So not much to talk about. So I was it good on to the next one. I didn't make one because I just used them from the Gargantos attack set and I just, I don't really have much to tell about that. Wanda, I put, I see Wanda when Scarlet Witch is dreamwalking into this Wanda from the different universe with Billy and Tommy. So, I just used this um, brown hair, blue spangle jacket, hands, legs, and I just put, I don't know where this is from, I just found, found it and put it on her. On to the next one. Next, we have Billy. Um, I actually like how this one turned out. So I use just this he brown hair, and then I put Jack from Hidden Child Head on. And then I use this Lego City Kid Toso and s smack some um, green arms on there, and then just put yellow hands to match the head, and then just some blue little legs onto the next one. Next one is Tommy. This one is not super good, but not super bad. I say in the comments if you like it or not. So I used the Peter Parker head and hair from the Jami Sayo Parker, whatever they call it, um, from the CMF head, and and I just put this body from head inside set on hands to match the head and just these light brown nail legs like I said I'm not super satisfied with this one so if you have anything that you know that could help for this custom I will be um, glad to know next is Komodo and but in the that universe 
um, his name is Kawamoto in that um, universe. So I used this black hair that I don't really know where it came from, but then I saw the head from the CMF. And then this body, this might, it actually unofficial. It, a splinter body. Well, any like rogue, like wolf. But then I used these legs from Ninjago, um, a set from the Ninjago movie. Then hence the master head, and that it. Blackboard is the first one. It used unofficial Lego pieces. I put on this um, bullseye head that was unofficial. I just saw it and I'm like, well, that good that you have that and for the four corners head but then you could use the Captain America head I know you're not black you could cut it back black one my friend um face echo 29 um uh, made one so you can go check out his he used a Captain America head and cut it black for his head now let's get to the rest of mine so this is a outrider torso flipped around with just black hands, black arms, and just plain black legs. This is um, a real rainbow as Captain Marvel. I used the what you want to call it? What that hair piece? I don't really know. With this face that I don't actually know where it came from. I just had it. And then, for any like gold, brown skin head would really work fine. Then Captain America, um, I mean, not Captain America, Captain Marvel, torso from a, his whole Kree outfit is Captain Carter. But this, this is if you don't have the Captain Carter moving figure from the CMF, that is, would look awesome. And I don't. You can go watch my um review and opening of the cmf up there to the custom i used this dark brown hair i got from mj then black widow head yeah black widows and i used any captain america torso with wolf but i used the one of from a zombie wolf, wolf when he all uh, weird away because you're not really Captain America anymore. This one, I love how it turned down. Mr. Fantastic. Just used this brown wavy hair for him. And then Captain America Vinny War head. And then I can't think of the um, name of her, but the golden person from Guardian of the Galaxy 2 Toto. And then Kara Dune legs with some black arms and hands to top it off and I really like it. This Professor X and the wheel tail. I will have a video of how I make the wheel tail. Um, but how I make Professor X. I use Gandalf head from Lego Dimension. Probably this any game Dolph head would use, but I'm not into Harry Potter, and I only have that because of Lego Dimensions. But yeah, that. It. But then the torso also comes from Harry Potter, from a Harry Potter finding book, Lego finding book. I got, and it have this this outfit any like black suit would work with the hands to match the head like i said i will do a um video on the wheel sale i will be i'm really satisfied how this turned out but i will talk more about it and that video that will be coming out soon um the strange dr strange from the illuminati universe i pretty sure he called it 818 that universe 
I'm not sure it did say it in the movie. If you know what I call it, please comment that down below. So, just the whole Doctor Strange mini figure from the set. Then I just used this skirt. It actually not a skirt, it's a cape. I just folded it up. Um, next is Sinister Strange. The head and hair from the Strange Wonder Dog Enters attack set. Um, plain black um, legs. And then the Ghost Rider torso from the Spider Man and Ghost Rider vs. Connor set. Zombie Strange. Under all that is just one body. Okay, from the Fendel Strange, I just use that same body, this cape, the arms, just all. Uh, that and I use a Batman from the Lego Batman wings thing and then use one of the outliers things and kind of just put like some joy arms and just the arms that outliers have on them for it then I use from that same set as these wings the crow head with this wit, uh, wavy hair so I use this Hell, long hell. Use this face. I don't really know where it came from. Then I use never the uh, torso with some um, purple arms and black hands, and then just all black legs, and that it. Thank you for watching. Tune in soon to see my um, wheel sale. I will be showing how to build it, and see you next time.